my channel. I hope everyone is staying healthy um, and just staying, staying safe with all this craziness going on in our world. So today um, I wanted to share with you what our kids are getting for Easter. Um, now this is going to look a little different compared to years past. I mean every year I kind of feel like we do something a little bit different. Um, you know, last year we took them to Florida for Easter, the year before we did some gifts. Um, it kind of changes every year based on the financial, our, fam our financial situation and really just what we have going on in life. So, um, considering what we have going on in life right now, as the whole world knows, we are in a pandemic and so we won't be going anywhere for Easter. Um, but we did do a little bit of shopping. Um, not everything is quite here yet. I will get into that though. And we didn't really go all out on Easter exact stuff, but anyway, guys, let's quit rambling and jump into the video. All right, guys. So to start off, um, because we are in a pandemic, we were not able to do a whole lot of shopping. Um, we basically grabbed some things as we did our normal grocery shopping a couple weeks ago, or not even a couple weeks ago, it was about a week ago. And unfortunately, you know, there's just not a whole lot of stuff on the shelf right now. Um, we didn't want to do a whole lot of walking around the grocery store um, based off of everything that's going on right now. So we kind of just saw some things or had some things in mind and grabbed them. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. So uh, first and foremost, we got chalk. This big boy came from Sam's Club. Um, I forget how much it was. If I can find the price, I'll put it on the screen below here. Um, but this is a lot of chalk and my kids love chalk. And now that they won't be going back to school until August, they're going to need this. I almost wish that I would have bought two of them. Um, so this has scented chalk. I have never seen this chalk before, but it's kind of cool guys. Oh, awesome. So. I was going to just give them the whole box like this, but look inside. I didn't even look inside yet. There's four of these little packs in each box, so I can do a separate um, basket for each kid. That is awesome because I wasn't really sure how that was going to work, but it looks like these are all the colors that come with it, so you get a nice variety of colors. Now, usually I buy Crayola chalk um, just because I feel like it gives a good color but I think these ones will be good I'm gonna open this one up here for you guys so that's what it looks like on the inside I think and I don't smell anything but I think they're gonna have a whole lot of fun with this regardless of whether it smells or not um, because my kids just absolutely love chalk it is like their most favorite thing in the world and it gets them outside you know um, and gets them some fresh air so that is the first thing on our item like I said I did get this at Sam's Club I don't know if it'll still be available or not but or even if it's available all over so I picked up bubbles I got a couple packs of them um, I was only gonna get one but then I was like you know what with them being out of school I think I'm gonna pick up two so we did go ahead and pick up two you know I don't know how long this pandemic's gonna last so I figured Two should last them for a little while anyway, unless they spill them, which they usually do. But I thought these would be fun outdoor. Again, get them outside, get them in the sun, some vitamin D going. So I also picked up another activity here. I picked up some paints for, these are for these little like sun catchers. I don't know if you guys have seen these before. Um you can see that there unicorn and then a little cat and we got a castle and a little fire truck a dolphin a rainbow a helicopter and a butterfly so um these are kind of like sun catchers. We got the little suction cups to go with them so they can hang them from their uh, windows. So I think I got two per kid. 
yeah, two per kid. So, and then this is perfect because there's eight little suction cups there. And then I did pick up some paint brushes to go with them. These are just kind of some little cheap paint brushes, nothing terribly extreme there. And then these are the paint colors that I got. Um, these all came from Walmart. Um, they're in the craft section at Walmart. So I was actually looking for something else for a, the kids' for a project for the kids' uh, for the kids' school. Um, they had a project that they needed something for, and I happened to see these while I was looking for something else. And so I picked them up. I think that they will really like them. All right, guys. So up next, we have helmets. Now, we have really picked up bike riding recently, um, especially now that it's slowly starting to get warm. So we're hoping to get some more warmer days coming up here soon. We, you know, part of our um, New Year's resolution or New Year's goals we wanted to get healthier and get more active and so bike riding we used to bike ride all the time um so we're gonna start doing bike riding again so we got our kids some new helmets so this one is mia's um these all came from walmart so i think they were like 20 bucks something like that 19.95 somewhere around there um this one is kendall's we just kind of picked out colors and uh, patterns that we thought that they would like. <clears throat> and this one is Hayden's. So we kind of guessed on sizing too. I mean, they have the sizing up here for ages. So we'll see what happens. Um, it does say that it's kind of adjustable as well. So I'm hoping that it all goes okay. And then, last but not least, here's Freddy's. <laughs> His was uh, $14.95, so 15 bucks. So we thought it was super cute. It would be super fun for him. And yeah, and then they will all be safe while we get off on our bike riding adventures. So next item is, next item? I don't know, items? We got these cute little slippers. You see those guys? We were um, getting ready to head out and we happened to see these on a rack. They were on clearance for a buck. A buck, a freaking dollar, guys. So, super excited for that. Um, we picked these up. These are for Hayden and Kendall. Um, Kendall's will probably be a little bit big. Hayden's might be a little bit small even, but the backs are open, so we figured that that was okay. And I mean, for a dollar, if they, you know, if they grow out of them super fast, a dollar is a dollar. So it's not a big deal. All right. Um, so for Freddie, we got him these cute little cars. He is obsessed, obsessed with Hot Wheels cars. He probably has hundreds of them. But I thought these ones were cute. The little ice cream truck and like a bumper car, um, you know, just different and like little cannon guy. You know, it's like the, like a fun park themed. So I thought those were super cute for him. Um, and then up next is Mia's random. <laughs> um, unfortunately, we have not received hers in the mail yet. I don't know if it's going to make it. We ordered it off of Amazon. Um, I will post a picture here. It is just a bunch of scrunchies. She lives for scrunchies. She is doing her hair all the time what 12 year old girl doesn't you know so we did order her i i can't remember how many scrunchies are in there but again i will leave a picture right up here for you guys to show you what that looks like um and then of course last but not least you can't have an easter basket without some easter candy so i did go ahead and pick up this big uh, um big bag of easter candy these came from sam's club um, I think it was like eight or nine dollars, so which is a good deal. What we will do with these though, we will put these in eggs so they can, um, except for maybe the Whopper bags, but the smaller pieces here, those will fit in those little plastic eggs so we can hide them around outside and they can hunt them. I think that would be a lot of fun for them, even though they haven't hunted eggs in a, probably a couple years, but I think it'll be fun for them. I'm trying to do the best we can with everything going on worldwide right, right, 
right now go ahead and give this a big thumbs up i hope everyone stays healthy um you know just make sure you're washing your hands and keeping your social distancing so anyway guys don't forget to hit the red subscribe button on the way out and we will see you in the next one bye